And welcome back, everyone. Welcome back to the Walski Group. I'm Maya. Well, as you can see, we're outside today. I don't know if you can pick it up on the camera, but it's actually snowing out here a little bit. So it's going to be kind of a quick video, but I wanted to show everybody how now part two, as you remember last week, I showed you how we're going to set it all up for our Christmas village. Well, this time around, I'm going to show you how I make the um, rock faces for our styrofoam. Now, if you remember, this is going to be on our right hand side. This is going to be our, um, our carousels and things like that. So instead of just having, as you can see right here, the plain look, what I want to do is I want to go to this kind of a look where you've got like gouges in here, scratched up, everything like that. So how do I do that? I'm going to show you on the corner right here and then on this other side real quick. Because uh, like I say, I don't want to be out too long in this uh, snow and all that kind of stuff. But anyways, what I'm going to do is, is I got 180 grit sandpaper right here. And just kind of fold it over to where it's rounded over. And like I say, you want to do this outside because I did this once in the house. It makes a total mess. But anyways, what you're going to do is, is I'm going to start on the top right here and I'm just going to kind of like just gouge in like this and making like X forms. So it creates like a jagged edges and I do the same thing on the corner. Just kind of going like this, just carving into it. Just making all different depths and highs and lows, things like that. And as you can see right here, let me get this up a little bit closer to the camera. Um, as you can see, it kind of, you know, it, it, it kind of gives it the look. But you're just going to, you know, just going to gouge in here like this. And we'll turn this around. Come back here a little bit so you can see. And again, same way, I got these push pins, the, the fabric, or uh, not fabric pins, the uh, floral pins in here. And the same thing here. Just go along the top right here. And I'm just going to kind of work it in, just, you know, rough it up a little bit like this. Push the pins back in, but kind of gouging it out a little bit. Things like that. And there we go. And what I do is, is just to like get rid of the looseness, I just kind of brush off my hand. Now, you may be wondering why on this side back here, I'm not going to do it. And that's because all of the villages are going to be placed uh, towards the back side here. And it's all going to be covered in anyway. So you're not going to see this flat side once we uh, build the villages. So, like I say, I'm going to brush this off. I'm going to take this back inside. And we're going to paint this again. I'm just going to like brush it in real light we're gonna do the um coat of the concrete gray go back over it with the black a little bit let it dry and um once it dries then we're gonna uh finish putting our walkways our villages and everything like that that'll be the start of part three which will be coming out on monday evening so make sure you come back and see that where we're gonna start setting up uh, all our homes uh the walkway fencing trees all that kind of stuff so if you like this video Please give it a thumbs up because it really does help out the video. And if you're new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button. And again, thanks for watching on this cold, snowy kind of a day. Hope you guys have a great one. And I'll see you next time. I'll see you uh, Monday, actually, for part three of our Christmas Village setup. See you then, everyone. Take care.